Hello there. I'm Tim Kern, half of the finance couple, and welcome to Two Minutes with Tim, where we look to infuse financial planning with just a little bit of common sense. Today, I want to talk about the pause that the Federal Reserve just took in raising interest rates. I got three really simple takeaways for you on this. And, and before I say this, please understand this is my opinion. First, my first takeaway is, look, I think the Federal Reserve has actually been doing a pretty terrible job over the last two years. And I think they continue to do a bad job. I mean, they stuck with this transitory inflation narrative far beyond where they should have. Everybody was chirping about how inflation was stickier, yet the Federal Reserve still said, no, we think it's going to be transitory. Turns out they were dead wrong. Second takeaway, very interesting. And when you read about what they've done recently in taking this pause, they're contradicting themselves. Let me read something to you. Chairman Powell actually said inflation has moderated somewhat since the middle of last year. Nonetheless, inflation pressures continue to run high. He also said, looking ahead, nearly all committee participants view it as likely that some further rate increases will be appropriate this year. So on one hand, he says he's going to take a pause and they're not going to increase rates. On the other hand, he says, however, we're going to have to increase rates later this year. So why take the pause? Why bother? They're basically saying we know inflation still remains stubbornly high and problematic, so we're going to raise rates. We're just going to stop here for a couple of seconds. Which brings me to my third point, most importantly, whenever someone, myself or anyone, including Chairman Powell, is trying to look into the future and saying, here's what we see happening, I always admit it, everybody needs to admit that as good as your educated guess might be about the future, you have to, you have to be a million times more convinced that you nor anyone knows what's going to happen in the future because it's in the future. It's unknowable, it's unknown, it's impossible to predict with accuracy what exactly is going to happen in the future. So I'm, I'm actually giving him and the other Federal Reserve members a break here. Look, please understand that interest rates most likely are going to need to continue to go up to break the back of high inflation, and it may entail a recession. And maybe I'll talk about that next week because remember recessions, although painful, are a very healthy and natural part of nearly every business cycle. So please enjoy the rest of the week. I hope this was helpful for you. Join us next week. Maybe I'll talk a little bit more about recessions. Have a great rest of the week, as I said, and please mind your state of mind. Take care.